Hi! Okay, so today I'm excited if you're watching this on, what day is it? June... June? It's September. If you're watching this is on September 3rd, you would know by now that Rare Beauty by Selena Gomez makeup line is out online and in stores at Sephora and the website. So, today is more like a first impression because I just got it and now we're just seeing how it is. <laughs> Alright, so I, so for like reference, I'm a light obviously with warm undertones and I'm not a makeup expert at any, at like at all. But we are learning out here. I've done it. I've done makeup at least a little bit since from um since college. So we are just trying out here. Yeah. And yes, I do have fedora. It's not fall yet, but let's pretend it is. Okay? Okay. So I am not reviewing every product or doing a first impression on every product online. I will tell you what I do have. That's a sample from Sephora. Well, it's not a sample, but it's the little points that you get. I got a liner. Oh, a Perfect Strokes, Strokes Matte Liquid Liner. <laughs> a little. Okay. Okay. And then we got a uh, Liquid Touch Weightless Foundation. I am, apparently I'm in the shade 180. So let's see what this, because uh, I had to ask a Sephora person. To help me yeah so let's see 180 so uh, apparently this is light with warm peach undertones I, I hope, hope it works then cuz I don't I don't know um, had a Sephora employee help me so I'm like okay we can try it out I mean no harm right nervous now but okay so um, I got the Liquid Touch Brush Foundation. You can use a sponge. I've seen people do a sponge. I've seen people use like fingers, but I don't think that's like the best. I mean, I, I do fingers for concealer because we're not paying for another like, what, 20 bucks for a brush? Mm. That's not how we do. Okay. I got uh, the Positive Light Liquid Luminizer and I'll show it when I open it. Um, I got Enchant. So let's see what Enchant is like described as. Okay. So Mesmerized Rose, which is a rose bronze, is Selena's go-to shade. I was going to get that. But I saw, I really liked this one more. And it's described as an Enchant Soft Pink. And it's a radiance finish, so. Uh, I got the uh, corresponding uh, concealer. So 180W. So yeah, um, just like the Fenty Beauty, which is super cool. If you have a shade in like a certain shade color and you want to see oh, what, or what concealer matches, you got it. It's right there, like Fenty. I got a soft pinch blush oh yeah this is the blush I was like wait this is the dewy liquid blush I have never tried a liquid blush in my life so we'll see how it goes I don't know should I keep the hat maybe when I'm done it's not okay Hello. <laughs> okay so anyways let's be serious here I got the lip souffle cream inspire which is I think Selena's go-to shade actually I really likes the packaging for this one. It's cute. Okay. Let's get into it, right? Okay. So, should get a primer. Wait, hold on. I gotta get a primer. Back. Okay, you don't, you don't have to have a primer. I just like to use it um, just because. During quarantine, I've not been wearing that much makeup. But I really like to, you know, just, uh, just, just to feel cute. Yeah. I've been mainly working on skin, on my skin, because 
I, I feel like I value skincare more often, more, but you need to have great skincare to like have nice foundation for your makeup. And I've been using the Amani Stuff Beauty a uh, scrub a uh, vanilla latte scrub and it really works I use it three times a week you don't have to use it excessively but I have sensitive skin but it works for me it's not really harsh at all which is surprising so little little plug in there but I use the Dior dream skin primer and yes I use my fingers also for me I don't wear like too much makeup like I like to keep it natural but when it fall comes the fall colors are coming out oh yeah okay I I told myself I would not buy any more makeup but it's Selena Gomez I've loved her since Disney's channel so we're gonna give it a try I mean I hope these products are still good I'm not gonna lie because I love her but no oh okay so this is the brush oh I'm so excited I really liked that it was kind of burgundy color so this is the foundation brush looks kind of cute oh wow look at uh, yeah. See that? Mm-hmm. We're taking it off, baby. Oh, wait. It's fine. Okay. Now you have this little thing. This little protector, which I really appreciate. Kind of reminds me of the Fenty Beauty, uh, one of their brushes, when I was using the powder. Translucent powder. So, yeah. I'll keep that here. So I don't really have a mirror with me, so I have me right here so if I'm looking here or I'm looking here um, I'm just reading off the computer to be honest um, okay first foundation open oh all of their packaging it seems like when you open stuff it's like a nice burgundy see she's so cute I fall I love this color. Okay, so anyways, um, I really liked this one. Is this cute? Hold on. I like it. So with this line, um, it's kind of like more natural it seems like, but with the color. You know, with Fenty Beauty, some of the colors are like pow pow in your face, like all the glitter glam. And this is a bit more natural, which, I mean, I don't hate. I love Fenty Beauty and uh, the looks, but I'm more of a natural gal, so, yeah. Okay, so this is what it looks like. <laughs> okay, it's a medium to full coverage with a natural finish. And obviously, it's a liquid. It's great for normal dry combination oily. Again, I have sensitive skin. Uh, do I have dry skin? Kind of. Only here, this part. Oily. Maybe T zone, but not. I don't really care, honestly. Like my concern for foundations and any kind of thing is how my skin will react. So obviously, it's a liquid. You want to shake this. Do you? Do you hear that? It's like a ball or something. It's like click, click. Just, just me. Probably just me. It's like a, when you when you do a marker, you know when you just shake it up marker, hear that? No, okay. You just have to do it yourself. <laughs> okay, anyways. Ooh, nice. nice. Oh, it's um it's a doe foot applicator. I think that's what you call it. Okay, okay. Very nice, very nice. <sighs> yes, when I have new brushes. <sighs> this is what I do. Um, so, I'm not sure how. Look in here because it's my mirror. Just... Okay. 
Also, if I'm doing something wrong, just give me tips. Let's help each other out. Um, no, seriously though, I look crazy. Oh, I hope it's my shade. I hope it's my shade. Also, I'm probably gonna rate how um, how easy it is to use. Cause for me, easiness with makeup, it has to be easy for me. If not, I don't know. Can you see? Sorry, this is the best lighting I have. But I really wanted to do this because it's Selena Gomez. Oh, wait. How do I, how do I look for... Okay. I don't look bad. What do you think? Should I keep it or should I? I don't think you can return it if it's not my shade, but we'll keep it. Hold on. Let me get a lip balm. Okay, back, back. Hope still recording. Okay, I'm back. I just took a little quick look in the mirror. Um, yeah, looks my shade. Cool, cool, cool. Now, this next part. I'm sorry if you're cringing. Um, or if you're cringing so far. My bad. Um, concealer. Again, like I said, I'm not paying for another brush. So. Yeah, I'm not paying for another brush because, and also, I use my fingers and it's like super natural, so. We gonna do that? <laughs> well, I just looked at myself in the little, <laughs> that's not my angle. Hold on. Do I have, do any of you have an angle that you absolutely love, like this side or maybe this side? I just do like any side. I don't know. <laughs> yes, I'm weird, sorry. Sorry, I'm not sorry, oh. R.I.P. Naya. Anyways, um, I just, you know, I had that song, though, just in my head when I said sorry, not sorry. Um, yeah, it was by Naya Rivera. Let's see what it says about the, um, con concealer. Okay, it's a brightening concealer, right? Yeah, it's a liquid touch brightening concealer, medium coverage, radiance finish, a foundation, for, oh, formulation is liquid. Um, Alright, cool. Let's try it out and see how easy it is. Usually with foundation, I don't know about you, but if I have a reaction, it'll be like red here. And I don't see red. Like, my skin's not itching right now. Things might change later on. I don't know. Oh, I should get my... Hold on. Again. I'm back. <laughs> this is my work study room. So I do all my work here. Yeah, I just got my... I only use one kind of powder. You know how people use the, Chans the Laura Mercier Chancellor powder? Yeah, not for me. I use the Fenty Beauty because I just love it so much. <laughs> There's no rhyme or reason. Hold on, let me take a sip of hot chocolate. A concealer. <laughs> Baby. Okay. See, with this, when you shake it, I mean, it doesn't sound weird. It's not weird, but I don't know. Do you notice that for the concealer, it's the ball is so much like skinnier, and it's and the foundation's thicker. So for concealer, you can use it anywhere that you please. I could easily use it here. I don't. I just use the under eye. That's it. I 
really hope so. Cause maybe you don't put concealer up here. Oh, I don't know. Apparently I do. I'll wash my hands later. Maybe that I really want to right now. This is gonna bother me. Hold on. Hands are washed. <laughs> so. Yes, I have to blow every time. Why? I don't know. I'm just. I'm not weird or anything, but it's just what I do. Oh, I have in the shade Lavender in Fenty Beauty, if you guys wanted to know. I really was going to say something, but then it, I didn't want to inhale it, so. Ooh, my skin looks kind of good. Yeah, um, once foundation, when I'm done with foundation concealer, I like to use this because I tend to forget. If any of you have the Fenty Beauty Lavender powder, it smells so beautiful. No, seriously, it smells muy delicioso. Not that I would eat it. Anyways. <laughs> Cringe, you're cringing at me right now. But um, here we go. I love this, it's so cute. Okay. Also, a big thing for me about makeup is the packaging. It has to look cute. If I, it looks cute and the formulation's cute, I'm grabbing two toward it. Okay. So, what should I do first? <laughs> Baby. Oh, let's do blush. No, 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 let's do liner. So I'm not the best at eyeliner. This is what it looks like. Is it a little like this? Moving on. Got the Lucid Blush. So if any of you know how to use the liner, tell me, please. I did look on um more I looked on other videos and it didn't like am I supposed to take this off because when I took it off it was it didn't have a bristle so or a brush I don't know but on. okay so this is the soft pink okay also fact um when I'm wearing this I mean it looks good I feel good but my cheeks just feel weird like, it's similar how when I used the Fenty Beauty highlighter, the matchstick, it felt like it was poofy almost. Like, I don't know. Hope I'll be okay. My skin just stinks. Okay. Yeah, so, I gotta enjoy. There are four different colors for radiance and matte. I chose the radiant because I was thinking of getting matte, but I really like it when I have a glow. Like, it looks super natural and it's glowy. So that's kind of my thing. And I've never used a liquid blush before, so this is going to be interesting. This is the color. Yeah, so this is a dewy muted peach. Never had peach in my life. I meant the color, not... Okay, anyways, so apparently you can do it here and do it here. Oh, it's not much. Oh, 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 oh snap. Uh, maybe this is good with the brush honestly okay um i don't have a blush brush a 
clown. A clown is what I am. Oh, uh, wait, I do have a blush brush. One side. Yeah, this... I don't... Guys. going well is it well hold on let me see if I have let's see if it makes it any better or if I'm just an idiot with look good I, yeah this is actually my first time with a liquid blush not even kidding I mean I look rosy Well, if anyone says that this has no color, they're clearly wrong. So, um, if you're new to makeup like I am, and you're new to... Does it look good? Sorry, I can't tell. If you're new to liquid blush, be careful. Get a sponge or something. Maybe that'll help. I was like, oh, you know what? I can use my fingers. You saw how it did? I don't know, man. On the other hand, I look pretty rosy. It's really, uh, what's the color, though? Oh, uh, well, that's my life. My life never works out. Let's see if I can... look better if you're a beginner if you're a beginner be careful you can clearly see I'm a beginner and I look like a clown clown so actually what I can do I think um I could put use concealer to cover it Let's see if it works. I'm just a little bit. wonder why um by concealer it's just brightening you know does it look better this side does you can still see huh? let me look in the mirror really quick i think this is doable okay i'm taking way too long um anyways this is my face okay yeah, um, I'm doing from a camera, so you can just see the connect, so so I can see myself. Well, blush, it's probably, it's like nice, like the color on me. I mean, it's very forgiving still, like when I do it, still cute, still um, natural, but you really have to like, know how to work a liquid blush i'm just you gotta know okay don't be like me not knowing anything like i've seen people like do a blush and it looks so easy but i guess i have seen a couple of people use this particular rare beauty blush and they had to do a sponge so i mean, i don't want to buy a sponge though i'll just use probably like liquid blush and then if it's too much um use the concealer so it's doable, I'm telling you. Okay, so I want to use Enchant. I want to see how it's described. It's like, did I say it's a cool pink? I think so. I was going to get Selena's go-to shade, Mesmerize, but I really like this a little bit more. I was kind of, I'm kind of afraid to use it because it's like so pink. 
Oh, it's described. It's made in Italy, guys. Yeah, this is described as a soft pink. I like it pinks. Can't tell by graphic tea, but... So, yeah, it's like the doe foot applicator, just like all the other products. So, how I like to... I've never done a liquid highlighter as well. So, this is a first for everything for me. So, if you're watching this and you're a beginner like me, let's learn together. Oh. I know you have to do the high points of your cheeks. I hope what I'm doing right. Like I'm trying to get away from my under eye because it's not where I want it. It's actually nice. I thought it was like so pink, but it's very nice and soft. Can you guys see? I hope so. Like, it's... I'm sorry, I can't tell without my glasses. But... That's why I hate using my hands. I am going to use Lip Souffle. Oh, gosh. So, I got this. It's very nice. And it's very, like... Velvety in a way. I think so. Anyways, um, this is a all of these lip creams. They're all matte finish, uh, hence the name lip souffle lip souffle matte cream lipstick. So it's apparently supposed to be hydrating, but I don't want to take any chances. I want to use a lip balm. My lips are very dry too. So it's really not like not the best to use liquid lipstick for my lips, but everyone's using masks now. Doesn't matter. Do I wear makeup when I'm at home? Yes. Why? I don't know. <laughs> so this is. Oh. I thought that would be a small. It's just like makeup. No small. <laughs> Maybe hints of vanilla. Sorry, I, I like. Okay. The applicator is not doe food, actually. It's... How would I describe? How would you describe this brush? I don't know. But it's like that. color. I didn't think it'd be this red. I feel cute. I might take pictures. Okay, so it goes on really smoothly. It's probably best to use a lip scrub and and a blush um blush um a lip balm too because i didn't use a lip scrub first and you can see the dead skin or something but yeah that's my that's a look i don't know if it'll set later like the lips because it's a liquid it's a lipstick right oh it's just a liquid lipstick it's supposed to be liquid lipstick I don't know. Looks nice though. Okay. Am I still in a gummies yet? Or do, do I look as cute? I don't know. Anyways. Um, but yeah, that is my first impression for her line. Besides, I'm still so mad at this. Like, I don't understand. Sorry, I didn't get to use this. Maybe next time but that's my first impressions as a 
Not a beginner makeup, but also beginner makeup. It's been four years. So you, you'd think I'd know by now. Apparently not. But yeah, this is like, I don't know. If you're looking to get into makeup, you should definitely try it. It's pretty cool. Um, what I recommend, it's like it matters, but <laughs> I'll tell you anyways. Definitely give it a try. Like Rare Beauty. I, I really like how it is on. Like it looks phenomenal. Like I look <laughs> like a delicacy, like a snack. Not really, but uh, <laughs> um, no, seriously. If you have sensitive skin, maybe uh, you can try it. Like try the foundation and concealer. Maybe just the concealer, but um, I know I tried the Armani one, Armani Beauty concealer, one of them, and it felt like my no, the concealer, what am I saying? The concealer made my eyes like watery, so it was not helpful. So I'm, I like to use different concealers and try it out. But yeah. Still feel a little weird here. Like my cheeks are poop puffy. Like it's, I don't know. Maybe that's just me. Maybe that's just me. Um, this is why I can't do glitter or something. But actually, it really looks nice. I, I, I truly like it. Again, if you're looking, if you, if you can do a liquid blush, props to you. I'm gonna learn how to do it more because not good at all. Like, no, the, the product is good. But what I put it on it's not I did you saw me do one dot right and I was like trying to blend it out I looked like a clown but then I had to use the um concealer so if you're phenomenal at it and you're amazing at it props to you this is so cool like how it feels <laughs> but no seriously the lips are a, um it's very pigmented it's a pop of color it's other colors too so if you're interested like I said, this pink one is really cute. I'm just saying. Yeah. Uh, it's a cool pink. You should try it. I think it'll look nice on any skin tone, honestly. But again, this this uh, liquid highlighter, it comes in matte and radiant finish. So if you're not into radiant finish but you need some matte, check that out. Uh, foundation is just really nice. I th I was uh, I was worried. I'm in. I, apparently, I'm in 180. Did you guys notice on the bottom? Like it'll, some of them say made in Italy and others are in Canada. Interesting. Um, the price point is actually pretty good. Maybe I should tell you about it. So the foundation is 29. Concealer is 19 dollars. This uh, lipstick is 20. 22 for the highlighter and blush. Uh, the blush is 20 bucks. The liner is 19, which I, I don't know. I would have to look on how to do it. The foundation brush is 28. Yeah, if, uh, there are more products on Rare Beauty. So if you're interested in anything else, like say you want to do primer, this primer, um, just check it out, see what works for you. But yeah, if you want, let me know what you guys think. Yeah, I'm a little all over the place. <laughs> You'll learn that about me. If I do more, I don't know. But, yeah. It's just me checking myself out now. Looks, looks nice. Oh, wait. Let me do... Cute. <laughs> the product's good. Okay, <laughs> sorry, um, that's probably not what you want here. But anyways, yeah, I think it's really cool. Um, it works nice. Again, for beginners, learning curve for you guys. Uh, foundation, if you can do, if you can put on the basics, foundation, concealer, and lipstick, and blush, blood, no, no, actually, let me backtrack. For beginners, I recommend the foundation, the concealer, 
uh, if you can put that on your face with no problem, you're golden. You can do a brush or a sponge with the with either product. I use my fingers for the concealer and I use the brush for this. Um, oh, did I tell you? I used this one, right? Yeah, yeah. The brush, I forgot. <sighs> yeah, this works really nice. Actually, I like it. Um, blush, learning curve. So be careful. I'm telling you. Uh, for beginners, just opts for a powder for now. If you really want to learn liquid, go ahead. At your own discretion. But, again. But yeah, highlighter is so easy to use, actually. Yeah. It's cool. It's cool. I'm sorry I couldn't do liner. If liner works for you guys and you actually know how to open it, don't be a dummy like me. Apparently I don't know, which stains everything. But yeah. That's me. That's my video. <laughs> but yeah, if you're watching this and you've watched it this far, thank you. That's really cool. <laughs> but yeah, you can see I ramble a lot. But <laughs> uh, thanks for watching. Bye.